what's up guys welcome back to another episode of satisfactory update 7 this is episode 53 uh this episode has been recorded a bit late i just actually finished my last um live stream which would be friday uh yeah so should have been yesterday when you guys see this so what we're gonna do this episode is we're gonna and pull it up so you guys can see what i'm talking about we're gonna automate the last component we need to make the blenders which is the radio control units for that we need the aluminum casings um the crystalline oscillators or whatever it's called and the oscillators and computers so we do have the other stuff automated we can build it right above this one or we can just build it right there because i don't think we need that much of it but we'd have to get the oscillators which are right behind that building there is the oscillators factory and the computers are right across here right behind the space elevator so that's what we need to do uh so let's get to that um first let's go get the computers and set them up somewhere around here with the conveyor belt let's go do that quick Uh, if you guys are wondering, considering some stuff that happened recently, I did get back my Twitch account, but uh, I have decided to stream on YouTube as some of you guys already figured it out. Uh, we're not going to be using these anymore, so it makes no sense having these on a belt. Going to this face elevator. Yeah, so... Computers there, what I can do. Is it coming out? Yeah. I just have a simple conveyor from here and run it all the way to near to that factory. I'm not going to run a, another um, truck station in that area. It makes no sense to run a truck station that close to any buildings are that close to each other. If we had drones now, then that would have been something. But I think the drones would also need like control units or something to do that. That's why I'm trying to automate all the new stuff that we unlocked. So we have that there. If I decide to build another floor to that, we can just convert it into that floor. As a matter of fact, I think I am going to build another floor. The next step is to get the oscillators down here. It's just going to be a simple um, truck station to do that. But before we do that, let's get into a bit of a bit montage.
there we go um welcome back to you guys on youtube who have been watching it during the build montage session uh yeah took some time approximately half an hour or so i don't know i'm gonna do that there comes the um coal truck for the that truck station there to turn stuff into scrap uh, here comes our first re remote control, not, re not remote, um, radio control units. There's our first two, and there's our second two coming down the line there. So, I don't know my, my, why my voice just got so freaking deep for a second there. Uh, <coughs> yeah, so that's our first four, officially first four automated I must say remote control unit again. First four automated radio control units. And there comes our second two. Two more coming from this one and there's the other two from that. It's fully automated, it's pulling the computers from the cup of tower that we have up there. One of the first buildings that we built. The aluminum casings is obviously coming in from right below it on the second floor and the oscillators are coming from that truck station which I set up to pull from the quartz factory built back in I think that was in one of the 20th episodes or something wrong in the 20s one of the episodes back then I can't remember which one exactly where we set up the quartz base up there behind the behind the fuel power plant and the rotor factory so what i'm watching at right there is the rotor factory behind that would be the quartz would be the fuel power plant and then the quartz um factory that's where that train is actually coming from yeah so that's where the oscillators are coming from with that truck station yeah um let me know guys if you guys want to see uh some sort of a tour of the factory at any point we are on episode 53 so we have been doing a lot in the save file also some of you guys who are new to the channel uh just so you guys know i do have my save files available for every episode from episode one till now it will be available on patreon most of the episode save files will be attached to an unedited version of that episode where you guys can see exactly what I did and my thought process during that build. If you guys want to support the channel and get access to those stuff and some other stuff within Discord and stuff, feel free to support feel free to support the channel on Patreon. The link would be down in the description. Also, on another note, before I wrap up the episode, as some of you guys know, my Twitch channel has unfortunately been hacked recently. And it got banned, but I got everything back a couple of days ago. It got banned, I got everything back, but I have decided, not really because of that, but I have decided that I would now be streaming on YouTube and I would be no longer on Twitch. So, if you guys see any weird messages from me on Twitch, like previously, before this video. Let me see if I can give you guys a date. Before the... That would be this... That would be like the 8th. Anytime, any messages before the 8th of August. Uh, Yeah, that was not me. My account got hacked somehow. I have no idea how. Again, this is actually the second time it happened uh yeah and someone was using my account to do crazy shit and got me banned yeah so that's the gist of what happened within the last week or two of me not releasing a video on youtube and anyway, guys hope you guys enjoyed the uh episode it's been a bit of a short one a bit longer than the last episode. I didn't actually realize that last episode was actually going to be that short. But yeah. 
bit of a short one. It should be longer than the last episode. Uh, but as you guys know now, we have the factory built. I added another floor. Last episode, we added the second floor to the um, bauxite factory bauxite processing. We added another floor here where we are turning those into room. I almost say remote control units again. We'll be able to do those into radio control units now. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. I'll see you guys in the next one. Be sure to like, subscribe, and do all the lovely stuff. Comment if you guys have any suggestions. Also, just for you guys to know the time schedule for live streams. So, as of recording this, well, when you guys will be seeing this video on YouTube, I should have a live stream this evening around 7 p.m. EST. So this video usually comes out around 10 a.m. EST. So 7 p.m. EST, I would have a live stream for you guys on YouTube. I'm not sure what I'm going to be playing yet. I actually just finished doing a live stream a couple, like an hour ago. And we was playing American Truck Sim, which you guys probably could see on the channel so yeah schedule for live streams would be mondays wednesdays fridays and saturdays at 7 p.m est uh note the schedule may change based on IRL stuff as i should probably already probably say this i have been notified that i may not be home in, um in the future as much because I did get an offer for a job back where I used to work so yeah hopefully that goes through and yeah I'll try my best to keep this a schedule and stream as much as I can I mean guys hope you guys enjoyed the stream enjoy the um video let me say stream enjoy the video I'll see you guys in the next one as usual do the usual you should up like subscribe and click on the bell icon to get notified when I do my live streams and when I release videos. See you guys in the next one. I'm out. Peace.